What's good, YouTube? How you all doing this evening? Hope you all had a happy New Year's and everything. Now, what I'm about to show you all is uh, my fictional roster version one that I am currently working on because I would like to start a series either with my GM or my lead. <laughs> Haven't decided. I might try it with both, but let me show you the roster I'm working on. <clears throat> so yeah, if, uh, this is what it is, fictional roster version 1.0. I actually did upload it. Yeah, let me show you all. appreciate everybody with the 145 downloads and this is before the actual uh, that was just the the base so how I did that was I went to the official roster deleted every player except for the like historical players I didn't touch any of the historical teams and how I got these players some I did custom make but like I said I, I went and uh, create a player let me show you create a player do a loader person back out and I would do that 13, 14 times to fill up a roster. And like I said, come to my uh, base roster, deleted all the real players on the team. Come over here, then uh, add to whatever team. This is uh, a player I just finished making. But let me show you three of the teams that I went in depth with. I'll start with the Hornets. Because I'm my plan with the league that I'm making is that what is it? The Southwest and Southeast teams are tier three teams, meaning that they'll have below average to average players maybe one or two above average players and as you can see I, like, I do have some players that are like 18 whatever but let me stop rambling So, and the reason I'm really working on the roster is because like, as you can see I'm actually trying to go in depth with the creative player and not give you that generic looking creative players like on some of the teams that I just threw players on so just going through here's all the custom players I also gave them custom names and as you can see with the Hornets they they are very mismatched team because as you can see let me they only have two centers and a power forward all the rest are they're mostly small forwards and guards and like I said let me show you how he looks this is all off the I just made that from scratch uh, Custom signatures.
these are all players that I went in depth and made. Try to give them all different type of signatures, different types of look and feel. And also with these, I don't, all the players in the league that I'm making, they will not have any badges outside of their personality badges because I want to see what badges they'll get over time through the seasons that they play and also with the custom players that I made I also did custom coaches Oh yeah, let me give him a, a headband. So yeah, they, I made a custom coach and everything. This is the, they can see their overall, the highest I believe is 75 for the team. Now you can see their only other center is coming off, is on reserve. I made a gave him a custom head coach. Actually, I'm trying to work the whole coaching staff. And this is his sliders. I gave him custom focus. I'm actually going through. And also, let me show you this too. Coaches won't, the coaches staff, I won't be giving them any badges either. And as far as team style, like, this was originally a GM, but I switched them over to head coach. And I'm trying to make all the, the actual coaches and everything, I'm going to, give them all F grades just so it'll be focused on all fictional and generic custom staff everything so for sure I gave them toughness size I'm probably going to adjust this more because I switched them gave him the was it grit and grind play style system yeah Also, as far as these proficiency numbers, I can show you how I came up with them. So let me switch this to the yeah, Atlantis defense. And also with that, it'll end up changing the some of the sliders, but not all of them. So, and I also gave them, made a custom playbook. And... I just said F it I just gave them all pick and roll so it's a, basically a pick and roll heavy team as you can see no other plays everything is run through pick and roll okay, double check Okay, and since I put on the uh, tendencies that leans defense, it went from 50 to 70 now. And everything else is the way I left it. Now I'm sure the Hornets and also made the Magic completely custom. Everything is, all the faces, everything I went through, edited them, tweaked them, made them myself. 
see. Go through a little couple more of them, show you the faces. And also for some of the shots, I ended up adjusting the player's height to like uh, in position. So I do have like centers with like let's say Derek Fisher's jump shot. So I actually had to change from 6'10 to 6 feet switch the uh, jump shot to Derek Fisher then go back to making him 6'10 and his position again the center so that's, that's a few workarounds that I found that you can do if you wanna like try to give a a player a certain type of shot and again uh, These overalls, like last sixty, mid to low seventies. Custom coach. Play through the star. Show you his uh tendencies and everything. And if you, oh yeah, kind of like it. And as far as the, like these proficiency numbers, I can show you how I got them right quick. Since I, you know what I'll say. Because I am still working on this. Because like I said, I, I finished Washington the magic and the hornets I'm still gonna work on it. and like I said for the for the coaching proficiencies this is what I did here I go yeah I just came into my team And I'm actually surprised I actually like this game mode. I haven't uh done too much as far as microtransactions. But yeah. And here's like I said, here's how I got the proficiency numbers. Set players. And then I just picked a pick a card. What did I say pick a card, any card. LOL. But uh yeah, see how it says system proficiencies like Allen Houston's ninety nine, all that. Kobe RIP. But since I made a like I said the Southeast and Southwest Conference is tier three. So nothing's gonna be as of right now. They're gonna be weaker. I just came over here found like my lowest rating. See and just use these numbers and put them to the coach because I believe that also will affect the rating or how they play if once I run through like my league or my GM
Yeah, so that was the magic. That was uh, the Hornets. And now I'll show my other team. Like I said, the Wizards. But I've done a lot of like the little test sims or whatever. But let me go ahead and show y'all. Wizards. Don't want this to be too long, but yeah. yeah. It is, like I said, I'm trying to go through and make all custom, like different looking players instead of like the generic looking players. Yeah, just trying to do something different. Also, uh, let me say the roster. Double check. And now, if you're wondering how I got the the players where their ages are 17 and 18, here's a little trick. Kind of create a draft class. And also, I do have these players on the, on this draft class, so I might upload it if you all want to holler at it. So, like, like this one, I'm also working on uh, going in depth. See. But yeah, so what you would do? Well, hopefully, this will work on here. I right, take a player we'll try Dylan Holmes take the player go to age make them 19 do whatever editing you want to do come to export player DNA Add new player, save player DNA, you can say whatever. So, but since it only needs four characters to save it, one, two, three, four. Alright, it's exported. Keep the changes. We see he's 19 on here. Go to player DNA. See? Now he's 18 years old, and also now I think depending on the month as well, it'll say 17 or 18. So as you can see here, 18 years old. But yeah, that's all I wanted to post. So just to show y'all, give y'all a little update on what I'm doing. So. Yeah, it's a little slow process because you know since working at the post office we're just now getting done with uh, peak season so I've been going here and there a little bit working on this and whatnot but like I said don't want this to go too long if y'all like it like and subscribe also if you all want to be a part of it Want, want me to make a player for y'all let me know and uh yeah like i said like subscribe y'all have a good one